It starts with a hug. Hmm. Well, thank Does. you for doing that, and thanks thank for giving you. people thank love. It's so what everybody fun. needs right now. Oh. Thank really you. proud of you and proud of El Paso. Thank you. Keep it up. There's a very real consequence to this. We've seen hate crimes on the rise in this country every single one of the last three years. And, and if you needed any further proof, what took place in, in Saturday should um, satisfy any open question about what the president has done. So, so do I believe that, that he wants to move forward on, on anything that would positively address the situation? A absolutely not. Someone who has constantly and, and consistently and, and vocally sought to make this country afraid of immigrants using the most racist, dehumanizing language, describing them as animals, as an infestation. Now, an infestation is what you would describe cockroaches in your home or, or termites or something less than human. You, you wouldn't talk about human beings that way. immigrants specifically who he's described as rapists and criminals, warning of an invasion, talking about an infestation, he is in large part responsible for what has taken place here. He'll have to answer for himself. I just want the rest of the country to know who we are. The safest cities in America and uh, it is safe because it is He's incited racism. He's invited violence. Um, these are the consequences for his actions.